Today, you've got the opportunity to bid on a low-risk suburban turnkey house that's got a ton of cash flow because we have incredibly high government guaranteed rent. Let's dive in. Hey, real estate investors, welcome to another episode of the Investment Properties for Sale show here on Holton Wise TV. As always, I am your host, James Wise. Behind the camera, we got Tommy cutting up the footage for us. This is our first show of 2020, and I am excited to be here. I hope you guys are all off to a good start in 2020. 2020 has been pretty, uh, pretty wild for us already thus far. Just the other day, the Indie Star just dropped, uh, published an article about that b Clayton Morris and his $7 million lawsuit against us. Um, if you've never heard about that lawsuit or about all the Morris Invest scam allegations, I'll put a link to the article and our documentary we made about that in the show notes below. You guys need to check that out. If you're a first-time viewer here on Holton Wise TV, I am about to sell you a property, and I'm going to provide you a ton of transparency and a ton of information on said property, and I believe this property is very low risk, but that does not mean you don't still need to do your due diligence, okay? You need to make sure you are getting third-party home inspections whenever you're buying a property out of state. A lot of the folks involved in those Morris Invest allegations didn't do that, and you'll just have to take a look at that material to see how it turned out for them. In addition, another great thing you can do is you can finance your deals using residential financing, 30-year financing. If you have not already been pre-approved by a lender, go ahead and shoot my team an email, sales at holtonwise.com. We will set you up with our list of lenders. These are licensed lenders writing you 30-year fixed interest loans, no hard money loans, none of that short-term high interest stuff. This is the best possible debt ever, long-term low interest tax deductible debt. That's what you want. That's one of the best reasons to invest in real estate. That's another thing a lot of the alleged victims in the Morris Invest scam, uh, that's another thing that none of those folks were doing in all those scam allegations, and that's why the whole thing uh, went belly up. It, it went bad. Again, in the show notes, you can check all that out. As for the property today, though, 18325 No Lane, Maple Heights, Ohio, 44137. This is a property in a nice little suburb in the Cleveland, Ohio market. Now, if you were to click the show notes below or punch the ultimate guide to grading Cleveland neighborhoods into Google, you would see that I have officially graded Maple Heights as a C-class neighborhood. However, I consider it to be more like a high C, low B, right? You take like the west side of Cleveland, like uh, the old Brooklyn neighborhood, for example. That's a pure C-class neighborhood. And then you take a neighborhood like uh, Parma, okay? I've graded that as a B. I would consider Maple Heights to be right there in the middle so even though it says c it's a you know high c we got a nice solid little three two bungalow nice little area we got a ton of properties i have priced this thing at only forty nine thousand nine hundred and as you can see right it's very clean crisp inside everything looks nice this is ready to rock and roll all you got to do is buy this bad boy and start making some cash flow i have priced it so well because there is just one little gotcha that uh, you have to do. It's going to be 49900 to purchase this thing. But in addition to that, what you're going to have to do, you're going to have to assume the point of sale violations. city like Maple Heights, uh, this is there's a lot of... A lot of uh, municipalities in the Cleveland market, they have these requirements. They're called point-of-sale requirements. What that means is whenever you sell a property in one of these municipalities, the city comes in, they do an inspection, and they issue these violations. And the seller cannot sell the property unless they clear off those violations or you, the buyer, agree to assume them. Now, what we've got here, I got it on the screen for you. I'm sure Tommy popped that up by now. We have the POS, which has approximately seven to ten thousand dollars worth of work the big things here that you got to look at right resurface entire driveway permit required uh, remove asphalt on front service walk they want you to tuck point some steps in addition they want you to scrape and paint uh, the front and back porch that is where the majority of the cost that's where the majority of that seven to ten thousand dollars is going to come 
Now, a lot of folks out there, they would probably uh, be really excited if the seller would go ahead and just fix all this and we can provide you guys this property 100% turnkey. Uh, unfortunately, that's not possible. Uh, number one, the seller, he doesn't want to do any repairs. You know, that's, that's one issue, right? You get sellers, they just want to sell the property. But uh, more importantly, the seller could not handle these repairs for you right now and still sell the property reason being as i said it's january right january it's our first investment property for sale show of 2020 that means we're in january it's cleveland guys it's cold you can't do concrete work in these types of temperatures so that's why we offer the property at such a low low price for what you're getting because you do have to spend approximately seven to ten thousand dollars up front so what's going to happen you're going to buy the property put down 25% or pay cash, but I would I would probably put down 25%. No reason you shouldn't finance this asset. Again, you'll get an appraisal uh, from your lender, which is another thing that helps you ensure you're not overpaying for the property. And then of course you want to do a third party home inspection. So you come up with your down payment for the property and then in a couple months, Holton Wise is going to need to go in and handle this POS for you. we got to wait for the, the weather to warm up. And that's going to get you this clean, beautiful property. Look at, the, uh, look at this living room again, man. This is just really nice. This is clean. These tenants are taking great care of this. In addition to the fact that they're taking great care of this, these are government-guaranteed tenants, folks. These are Section 8 tenants. We are bringing in $1,102 a month, and that is guaranteed in a super low-risk area. So this is a home run deal. This is a solid deal to start off 2020. I anticipate a ton of offers and a ton of interest in this uh, coming my way. So if you are another investor out there who's interested in this, you could go ahead and send your offer to sales at holtonwise.com. You need to understand we're going to have multiple offers on this. I would anticipate at least 10 to 20 offers. So you need to be organized. You need to be ready. You need to put the property address in the subject line. You need to have your proof of funds, which is money in the bank, or your pre-approval letter, which is a pre-approval from a licensed lender. If you're not ready, you're not at that stage yet, you're brand new to investing, totally cool. Just shoot my team an email, sales at holtonweiss.com, asking us to give you our list of lenders, and we will send that off to you. Other than that, that's all I've got for you folks today. If you guys have more questions about point of sale requirements, uh, in addition to the show notes uh, below, all the Morris stuff I told you was going to be down there, I want you to check down there uh, for a video, a nice little highlight video we made about point of sale in the Cleveland market. Investors ask me about the point of sale stuff all the time. So we just we took some pieces from some of the MLS search and analysis show, and we, we compiled it in a nice little highlight video so you guys, get the opportunity to learn about that. And before I let you get out of here, as I mentioned, the MLS Search and Analysis Show, there's two ways to buy properties from us here at Holton Wise. All right, so if you go to the Property Search button on our website, HoltonWise.com, you could click the Investment Properties for Sale Show, which is what you're watching right now. This is the one where you want to make sure you subscribe to our mailing list as well because every day at 1 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, we mail this out to you guys, and you have the opportunity to bid on these properties. These are properties we're selling. But in addition to that, the Cleveland market's big, y'all. So you click the MLS Search and Analysis Show. That's the other way you can work with us, work with our team. There's over 5,000 realtors in the Cleveland market. So outside of what we're producing for you here on Holton Wise TV, there's a lot of investment opportunities, and you have the opportunity to work with me, work with my team to bid on all of those properties. In all of the situations where you get an analysis product from me, I will break down the investment. I will break it down for you in the same way I do on this show. I'm going to go over your estimated income and your estimated expenses and really talk to you about about the house uh, as an investment, as a, as, a, as a monetary vehicle, as opposed to what the majority of realtors do, which is treated as something that uh, you know folks are going to want to live in. Because I know you're watching this show because you're trying to make money. You ain't trying to move from California to come to Cleveland. So that's what we do. And even before you spend all the money to get one of those, you might want to cruise down here, get yourself a real-time MLS feed. What this is is this gives you my broker access. So the moment a property goes on the market by any agent in this market, you're going to get an email from me immediately. So if it goes online, if it's available for sale at 4 p.m., you'll get the email at 4 p.m. And I've already pre-sorted them based on things that you guys want. So I've already separated them into A, B, C, D, and F asset classes, and then I broke it down to single-family homes, multifamily properties, or those big apartment buildings. That's it. 
That's all I've got for you. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. RentTech Direct provides you with an easy-to-use yet robust platform for managing your properties, complete with its built-in reporting and accounting system that can be customized to fit your business. You can manage work orders and even accept them online from your tenants. You can also share work order details with tenants or owners if you wish. With RentTech Direct, you will also fill your vacancies faster than ever with the built-in marketing tools. Just enter the details of your property and RentTech will automatically provide you with a professional online website as well as syndicate them to popular websites such as Zillow, Trulia, and Apartments.com to get your listing maximum exposure so it's rented fast. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content, including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from health. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.